In today's episode, we'll be discussing the most unusual internal combustion engines, some of which have the potential to truly revolutionize our world in the near future. It's going to be fascinating. Let's get started. Introducing the spherical engine by German engineer Hewitland. This ball-shaped internal combustion engine was unveiled at the Geneva Motor Show back in 2011 as part of environmentally friendly technologies. According to claims, this engine boasts a high efficiency of over 30%, produces fewer harmful emissions, and due to its compact and simple design, it's an excellent fit for hybrids or as a range-extending device for electric vehicles. The operating principle is both interesting and straightforward. Inside the engine, there are four arc-shaped pistons that are paired and directed toward each other. Each piston resides in its own cylinder and moves along an arc-shaped guide. The engine operates similarly to a conventional four-stroke internal combustion engine. The four strokes are intake, compression, ignition, and exhaust, and this cycle repeats. One significant advantage of this solution is that the entire structure contains three times fewer components. There are only 62 parts in total. The engine weighs 62 kilograms and, with a displacement of 1.2 liters, it delivers an impressive 100 horsepower. While there are other developments of spherical engines, none of them have entered mass production at the moment. Coaxial engine. Coaxial Motors is a company developing their own type of internal combustion engine. Here we see a piston moving along a groove in a circular guide. Two pistons move along these guides, facing each other. Valves are added, which open and close when they encounter this protrusion. In this way, the engine operates according to the four-stroke cycle and utilizes the same principles as a conventional internal combustion engine. However, an ideal balance is achieved as the pistons move simultaneously and in different directions, compensating for each other. By following the path of the guides, the pistons are able to dwell in the dead points longer, allowing for more efficient combustion of the fuel-air mixture and increasing the engine's efficiency to 55%. As a result, we obtain a compact engine without vibrations, with high efficiency, and improved environmental characteristics. The disc engine. The idea of this type of engine emerged as early as the late 18th century when it was initially used as a hydraulic motor. However, it has also been adapted for fuel use. In fact, some articles mention its experimental use in unmanned aerial vehicles due to its compactness, minimal number of parts, simplicity, and light weight. McMasters is currently developing the disc engine, and according to their claims, their variation will be able to run on a hydrogen and oxygen mixture, producing an output power of over 200 horsepower. It's a unique motor from the Spanish company InEngine, which they refer to as neither a four-stroke nor a two-stroke, but a one-stroke engine. The motor has a cylindrical shape with four cylinders and eight pistons. With a single stroke, this engine delivers four times the power of a classic four-stroke engine and twice as much as a two-stroke engine. However, it does not have the drawbacks associated with two-stroke engines since there's no need to mix oil with fuel, and the intake and exhaust are located in the cylinder wall. As a result, this engine is even more efficient than a four-stroke engine, environmentally friendly, much lighter, and smaller in size. To demonstrate its capabilities, they have installed this engine in a Mazda MX-5. With an engine displacement of only 0.5 liters and weighing 35 kilograms, it produces 120 horsepower without any turbocharging. Additionally, thanks to the opposing motion of the pistons, they counterbalance vibrations, resulting in a smooth operation without any noticeable vibrations, as if it were an electric motor. In my opinion, this engine has the potential to revolutionize our world and is ideal for both aircraft and hybrid vehicles. Despite its compact size, it is capable of delivering high power. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, it means a lot to me. Share your thoughts on these developments in the comments section.